Hey guys, Tech Launcher with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to transfer your existing eSIM card from your old phone to a new phone in a couple of different steps. Now, we're going to show you how to do it really simple and easy. If you already set up your phone like I did over here and you have an existing phone and you just like to move over the eSIM card, how do you do that? Well, it's going to be really simple on the latest iOS version. Now, this has to be on iOS 16 or later. So, if you're an old phone, it has to be iOS 16 on your older phone. And first thing you need to make sure that both phone have their Bluetooth connection on. So you can kind of go ahead and check that the Bluetooth device are on on both of the phones. So this is the old phone I have that has the SIM card and this one doesn't. So I'm going to move it over to the new iPhone 15 Pro here. But this will work on any phone that you have. So all you'll do is simply go into your new iPhone. And once you go into your new iPhone, all you'll do is go to a cellular here and then set up cellular or add an eSIM card if you already have a physical SIM card. And the way this works is if you have your old phone nearby, you can actually transfer it by using this option, which is transfer from nearby iPhone. And once you click on it, it will ask you, as you can see here, this prompt pops up just like that because it detects that you have a phone close by. And you'll hit continue here. And once you hit continue, all you have to do is enter this verification code so you can move over the service uh, right to your other phone uh, just like that so that's how simple uh, it is to do that now here i won't do that because of course i'm keeping my old phone here but after you enter the code your sim card will be set up and ready to go and that's how you set it up now let's say that pop-up message that we did let's try it again maybe that pop-up message doesn't pop up what can you do well another way you can do is if you have a QR code that's available for your carrier. Sometimes your carrier can provide a QR code or you can enter the manual details here on your iPhone to set it up. Both way it works. If that doesn't work, just contact your carrier and let them give you a QR code. Usually you can go to uh, the QR code is going to look something like this. Let me just show you really quick. QR code. Right, it's going to look like a code like this, and then all you'll do is just scan it and it'll give you the detail. Of course, this isn't just any QR code, but you get the idea here, just like that. And you could also transfer your existing SIM card because the new iPhone 15 Pro and the US model doesn't have a physical SIM card. But if you do have a physical SIM card, we explain in another video how to take out the old uh, SIM card from your old phone and turn it into your new phone if you want to check that video out as well. So I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.